Hello guys. So, um, this is Friday. Uh, I have my Gracie girl here. She's playing games on her phone. Um, last night when I was ending our last vlog, which was Wednesday morning vlog, because this is our, no, it was Friday morning vlog, this is Friday. This is the one I'm working on, it's Monday morning vlog. So, when I was trying to close that one out, I had meant to show y'all and tell y'all that we have a butterfly, and I forgot. So, I'm going to show it to you now. But that was, let's see, today's Friday. I have to think back, tomorrow's Thursday. Yesterday is when the butterfly hatched out of the cocoon. Okay, then today I got up and we had a second butterfly. So, here we go. Let's see. All right. There's one right there. And it's these two over here, left and middle, that hatched. That one has not hatched yet. See how it's darker? And then the two laying on the napkin has not hatched. Now that one right there, we they the paper said they eat watermelon. And Albert had gotten a watermelon, so we put a little piece in there, and it's in there eating. But that's the bowl. They eat off of the cotton right there because it's got sugar water in the bowl, and that's what they eat. So, she's named them Posey and Rosie. Look at its tongue with it eating. That long thing is its tongue. If it's, well, if I could keep it on it. And I know it's not focusing good through the net. But it is moving. It's cool how they do their tongues. I wonder if we're going to have any more come out. But also today, oh, we've been crafting. She made a... A caterpillar. No, that's its legs. That's its face. This is its legs and its body. This is the cocoon. It hangs like this. And then it comes out as a butterfly. And that's its head and antennas. <laughs> okay, we also been doing it's thundering. We got a little bad weather. It's been raining. I'm gonna take y'all out here and show you. We've been out here crafting. She pulled this out and started gluing sticks together. But we've been painting our rocks. Our paint and our rocks, her kit. We got a few more left to paint, but this is the kit. And then we gotta put our stickers on when they dry. So that's what we've been oh, doing today. Yep. Y'all hear that thunder and see the rain out here? Yep, 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 yep. So this is our weekend vlog. This will go up Monday morning. This is Friday. So we'll see what else. If I get to organize anymore, I'll show that y'all. Update y'all now. What are you schooling about now? She gets excited when she sees stuff that she really likes. It's fun to her and she squeals. <laughs> I guess she's watching something instead of playing a game. All right, guys. We'll see y'all later. Till we find something else to vlog about. Bye-bye. Y'all look how pretty that is. So beautiful. Oh, it's moving, see? Look. It's showing off for y'all. Moving and turning. Woo. Look at it, flapping its wings, yay. This one has not moved much yet, but they said at first they gotta get the blood flowing through their veins and their wings and get them stretched out hard. So they'll move around good. Hadn't had any more hatch out yet. Look how pretty. She's watching her cartoons over there eating lunch. Okay, talk to you later. Hello, everybody. Welcome back again. This is Sunday. So, I have done some more work. See the difference? I didn't quite like it how it was, so I turned that one, you know, to the back, 
and I've got these three up here across here and then I've laid my yarn cubby hole thing across there and I've got some plastic canvas light stuff sitting on that. I have my cushion, my pin things sitting up there. Now, the only thing is I don't have the rod to hang this on. I would really like some way to hang that so that it's cute and kind of looks like toilet paper. That's what it was meant for. I have rearranged the inside of the drawers. All of these are scraps, kind of big, long strips of scraps that I can cut up some more. This is string yarn and ribbon trim scraps in here. Uh, this is bigger pieces of scraps in here. Now, this is some new fabric. And then this is bigger pieces of lace here. And then this is tool. It, this side is big pieces of tool. This side is cut up scraps of tool. All right. This here is some more fabric. This is... You know, everything over here in this corner in these drawers has to do with fabric and yarn and lace and sewing. So, all of this stuff like this, okay? Feathers and uh, fabric flowers and stuff. And then this is my embroidery threads. The last three drawers, I had three containers like that. So, in each drawer is a container of thread. Now, this is some more big pieces of fabric, but I am not going to get any more in the drawers. As a matter of fact, these two, I'm not going to try to close them all the way. I took enough off of here that it's still a little hard. Uh, that's why I'm leaving them open. But it's a little bit easier for me to get them open and get there to those two last drawers. So I'm just going to leave them out like that so it's easier for me to grab and pull them out. Um, so, this stuff's not going to fit in there. It ain't going to fit in none of those. It, in other words, look at too much. They need to be cut up for scraps. Or maybe I'll just store them in my closet when I get around to that part of the closet. It's going to be the last part to organize. Uh, until I use some of this up and need more. This is some of my old shorts and stuff. And... I need to cut them up for scraps. And then this was that rug I had bought a while back. I want to undo it and unravel it and take all that out and use that fabric. So, this corner is set and fixed. Now, the stuff that was with all these drawers has nothing to do with fabric and lace and sewing. It was what I call journal stuff, paper stuff, cardboard stuff. So there's pretty straws. Here's cardboard pieces here. And this is die cuts and uh, the little cardboard pieces, but also what they call, uh, is it punch board or something like that? Anyway, and then we have the cards. You know, this is all cards and other type paper stuff that I've saved. That's mostly cards there. And this little box was with it. And this is some paper things to craft with. All of that will go together along with all of my other paper things, my papers, all my crafting stuff like that in that way. Now this here, sorry, I'm holding my cord, is, see, I haven't gotten into this box and used any of this because it had a lid on it. And then it was over on top of those and other stuff was on top of it. See, this is how I am, the kind of person I am. I need it easy reach, easy get to, and see so that I can even remember that I have it and can use it. So, no lid, okay? So, I've turned the lid upside down and the box is sitting in the lid. So, this is like this kind of stuff. The plastic paper... Uh, ribbons and stuff. Okay. I guess I'll leave that hanging. I got this empty, but I got to figure out what I'm going to use it for later. Now, in these are empty. Okay. I'm going to end up using them, you know, with some paper stuff or whatever for it. 
This box is doilies, and this is yo-yos. So that box and this box, I really would like to have over here, since it's fabric and ribbons and, you know, doilies and lace, and it goes along with that. I just, I don't want to set them on top of my yarn thing because it may start looking messy and it may push it down and make it hard to get the yarn out. I don't know. We'll see. So I got to think about what I want to do with that. That's the only thing really about that that's out of place right now. This is still Gracie's Corner temporarily until I finish getting everything moved around. Okay, next step. That thing right there I'm putting out on the porch that's my baking soda books, and I'm going to switch it out because I've got little things here to put in there. And then I got under that table in the living room and yonder is boxes full of books that I've still yet got to put in there. And then the rest of that is scrapbooking stuff, you know, paper stuff. I'm probably going to put that cart in front of this cart. I'll move this out in front of it because that's also paper stuff. Now, this is temporarily... But just to get it from being haphazard and so I can get to my closet and so we can move around better and get to moving other things. Um, that's what's going to happen there with that. And then I'll be ready to start on moving the rest of it. In which case, I will start with, I'll start with clearing both tables. And for this... I'm going to have to tote everything out there and put it on the couch in the living room. When I get these two tables cleared, I'm going to clear everything out of that. Then I'm going to pull, take it off, pull the tables out. I'll pull Gracie's desk out and I'll start rearranging all of that. And then refixing and placing the stuff I want in those shelves where I have them and all. And then we'll move on to... You know, I'll be rearranging the stuff on the shelves, and then I once I get these kind of empty, I can move them, them shelves. And then I can, the last stuff will be placed in the carts, and, you know, the last of the little stuff, and exactly where I'm going to put Gracie's desk. And then it will be the closet. So, there you go. Alright, guys, that's all for now. Just kind of wanted to update y'all on that, and... You know, we're still working on the porch, too. I mean, Gracie's got to get back to her uh, uh, painting the rocks out there and fixing that up out there. And, um, all right, until then, I will uh, see y'all later. Bye-bye. Well, guys, I guess this will be the end of my vlog for this time, the weekend. This is Sunday night. It'll go up in the morning, Monday morning. So this is a sign off. Another peek at our butterflies, if I can find them. So one is sitting right there on the cotton eating. And there's another one somewhere. Sometimes they're hard to find. There he is up under the handle right there. On the top edge under there. Okay, I did take the disc out. And the napkin that was laying in the bottom, we throwed it away. We didn't get no more to hatch out or anything. And uh, so, I'm tired. I'm hurting. I'm still trying to get myself back up where I can move good and do things and not hurt. I hadn't done much more uh, organizing. Uh, hopefully, can work on that tomorrow. I, I gotta try to do some dishes. <laughs> some dishes tonight. Uh, I've kind of been told that I'm gonna have company Tuesday. So I wanna get my dishes done if I can, as much of them as I can, and have a little lunch prepared. But. <laughs> We'll see if that company comes or not, or if it fails. <laughs> but I know life happens and sometimes things happen and you can't make it. 
what you planned, but it would be nice. So I hope she can come. I will, of course, video it if she does. All right, guys. So this is it. I will say bye. Let's go up in the morning, Monday morning, and then I will be starting tomorrow vlogging my, oh, sorry, y'all, uh, my Wednesday morning vlog, which hopefully will be better, and I won't be hurting, and I can move and do and work on organizing my craft room, plus work on that porch out there, and, you know, do some more fun stuff. All right, I will say bye until then. I'll see y'all then. Bye-bye.